Good morning. I am so bright red. I did an hour on the elliptical today, cross trainer. That's all I did. My feet hurt so much. I have a blister. I tried to run and then it was just rubbing. So for some reason the elliptical doesn't hurt blisters so much. I found today. So that was great. Today's plans. I need to edit Wednesday's video, Friday's video, and maybe Monday's video. And um, I went to the gym a little bit later today. It's quarter to 11. I went to the gym a little bit later because I was planning this morning, planning my videos for the week. So that's all done. I've also got some PO Box mail. I'll show you that later on too. Oh, I'm so hot. I'm gonna make a smoothie. Let's be real, this looks revolting. <laughs> well, it kind of looks like a chocolate milkshake with chunks of green in it. it. Just tastes like coffee and banana. I ran out of protein powder, so I was like, eh, I'll do a coffee one today. I felt like coffee. I die. Louis, you are the cutest. Yes. Look at you. He loves my new nails. I was like lying there last night scratching him and he was just like in heaven. Doggy heaven, eh? And then when I stop, he like gets all angry. Well, not right, well, kind of. He like nudges my hand with his nose. He's like, don't stop. I think he's feeling a bit lazy like right now though. Hey. By the way, people always say like, oh, his nails are so long, like trim them. But he just has a very long pink part to his nail. And he literally got his nails clipped like, how long ago? A week and a half ago? Yeah, they just look long all the time. But don't worry. He's fine, aren't you? I get them professionally done because I'm terrified of clipping them too short and making him bleed. It's like my biggest fear. Mm -hmm. He loves it. Here's my lunch. It's the muscle fuel, I think, I can't even remember what it is. It's like brown pasta and vegetables. And I put some cucumber sauce on top. And if you wonder what that noise was, it was him. Put some, put some, put some. He makes a really weird yawning noise. He's like, Arr! sounds like a little dinosaur. Hey, back. So this is happening. You make it very hard to work, Lou. Just putting together a thumbnail at the moment. I just exported my purple lips to check it with me. It's such a fail. Like, not the actual, like, video. But I just was having such a mirror of a day applying my makeup. So, hopefully you guys like it. I'm a bit whingy in it because I just keep complaining that I keep screwing my makeup up. But at the end of the day, I actually don't mind the makeup look now that I look at it. And it just goes to show that you know nobody is perfect especially not me and it's very chitty chatty chitty chatty so hopefully you guys enjoy it i think i'm gonna put this up tomorrow wednesday so i just uploaded a daily vlog on my vlog channel it's 4 30 um i also finished editing friday's video and monday's video i mean wednesday's video i'm really hot i want to go wash some more brushes i'm feeling so upset right now there's just been some stuff happening in like personal life it's nothing to do with me and hamish don't worry <laughs> hamish is my solid thing in my life okay just other stuff is happening and it's stressing me out i just don't want to talk about it because i don't want the situation to get any worse i'll probably address it at some stage but right now i'm just not gonna talk too much about it because i feel like sometimes when you start talking about things that people get carried away and start doing it more do you know what I mean? Like not just with like what I'm talking about, just with any situation in life. Like people just like to annoy you. Sounds really bad. But anyway, and then I just read this thing on the SPCA page. Skip forward. This could be like a trigger warning, but just some guys training his dogs to attack a goat. You guys know how much I love dogs. You guys know how much I love goats. And it was just like the most awful article. I'm not going into detail because I will literally start crying again. I've been crying about it. It makes me so upset. These people should be sent to prison. But no, they just have to do some community service and pay a fine, like whoop de doo It's not even a massive fine or anything. These people, like, ah, uh, they just, ugh. Why are there so many evil people in the world? Like, there are so many assholes, and I'm just like, <sighs> just put me in a bad mood. 
I don't know. I just feel sad and I want Hamish to come home. He's at the doctor at the moment, which reminds me, by the way, my wisdom tooth has stopped hurting all of a sudden. Hamish said that this will happen. He's like, they'll come in and out, in and out. I don't know. But yeah, they don't hurt at all, which I'm kind of happy about. But I'm still going to go to the dentist soon. I'm actually due for my yearly checkup in like a week or so. So I'll either go before or after I go to Australia. I don't know, I'll just see when I have time. I just feel so deflated. I think it might be a time for another B12 shot, to be honest. Like, I feel so deflated and not like myself in the last few days. Like, I don't know if you guys have noticed on YouTube, but I just don't feel happy. I don't know. Someone said um, on my day 173 um, that they don't know if I'm still doing the RTVs, but this is Shannon V. Other than the secret stuff you can't talk about yet, what are some things you'd like to do and achieve this year? Honestly, a lot of my goals are in motion right now, which I guess that gives a lot of hints. I have been working my little white ass off, as you guys might know, I don't know. I'm trying to get my goals in order. Other than that, this year, I really just want to focus on myself, which sounds selfish, but... Last year I feel like I pushed myself a little bit too hard with these vlogs in the end. Like, I love doing these vlogs. As I always say, I'm not saying I don't like doing them. But there's a balance of, like, making sure I still give myself some time. And filming these vlogs every day. That's kind of, like, the fun part, the easy part. But then editing every single day, like, including weekends, is just a bit, like, overboard once I've already... You know, like, this is only my second channel. It's not even my main thing. I do three videos on my main channel as well. I'm trying to figure out what to do like I don't know if I should just merge these vlogs together a little bit like I kind of have been doing lately um, I don't know if I should upload less on my main channel like I just don't know where to go but my goal this year the thing I would like to achieve this year is a little bit more relaxation I guess a little bit more like chill time a little bit more me time a little bit I don't know it's so hard any of you guys out there that are self self-employed you know like it is hard to separate like work and pleasure because when you work for yourself there's a lot more pressure there's a lot more things to do and you know that's the thing like people are like oh you work for yourself so you can just have off as much time as you want but it's kind of not I would not change my job for the world I love it to bits but it is like hard trying to separate like you know me time and work time so I'm trying to figure that out and I just I don't know I'm not very good at it that's one thing like yeah last year I was just overdoing it a little bit like I was still very happy and enjoying myself but I just was always exhausted and like there wasn't enough time off camera so I'm trying to figure it out I don't want to stop these vlogs because I genuinely enjoy them but it's also getting to the point where like some viewers are like most of you are so kind and chill you know but some viewers watch these vlogs and they get they kind of lose the boundary point I guess and like you know, last year with the whole, like, boob grabbing, like, it's just, boundaries are starting to get blurred, including things to do with, like, my home and just, um, like, people coming up to me and saying certain things in real life, including people that don't watch me, that, like, you know, parents of my viewers saying things, and it's just, I don't know, I just don't know what to do about my channel. I guess I've just got to stop being as personal but then I feel like it's so boring like it's just like what do I even talk about then in vlogs you know what I mean I don't even know what to do like my life is so confusing right now I'm just trying to figure it out I'm so red right now I'm just hot and upset and weird you know I say these things to you because like I feel like I'm talking to a friend but then I always know there's people out there watching me that really like can't stand me which is weird because I'm like why are you watching me but you know what I mean like so I say these things and then like I put them up and then most of the time everyone's supportive and then all of a sudden I get all these like assholes as well and I'm just like why did I say that and it's probably gonna be the same situation here like I don't know I just don't know where to draw a line and it's like I need to draw a line so other people realize where to draw a line if that makes sense like, I don't even freaking know I know Hamish says that I should give myself like the weekends off but the fun stuff happens on the weekends like that's when I want to vlog so it's so tricky I don't even know I'm gonna go wash some more brushes because it is therapeutic and I just feel like I just need some time to relax and think, you know? And it's funny because usually everything about YouTube is what makes me the happiest. Like I am the happiest when I'm doing YouTube stuff other than like if I'm just chilling with Hamish and enjoying myself like that way. But I mean like I love my job, I seriously do. It never makes me upset normally. Like unless it's just like, you know, typical haters or whatever, like if I'm having a weak moment. <laughs> but for some reason today, I just don't feel good. It's just one of those days, I guess. 
I'm also really gutted because I found some footage of like a first impression. You know that first impression I did with the two um, HD Make It Forever foundations? Like, I can't find the rest. Like it just ends. And like now I don't know what to do. And I'm really upset about that. Like I don't know if the um, footage corrupted, if I accidentally deleted it. I accidentally deleted like all these bloopers files the other day. And I was like real hard on myself for that. And oh, I just don't know. This little goober makes me happy. Lily! <laughs> Hi! You're so cute, I love you. Alright, I'm gonna get off my camera for a while and go have some me time and I'll talk to you in a bit. Simple dinner tonight. I'm gonna open up some P.O. Box mail. Um, I'm gonna show you some of the stuff and then letters and things because I know some of you said that you don't like watching me read letters and stuff. I'm just gonna write down in the down bar like all the names of people that sent me letters and stuff and yeah so you can see if i got your letter i'm gonna read them all tonight so the first thing i opened up is a gift from 20th century fox it's like a big book with comics in it how cool is this i used to love reading these as a kid Annie tracy if you're watching i remember reading all her like Gar 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 garfield comics and things like i love them like is this not super cool thank you so much to whoever sent me that from 20th century now this cute package from Zakira. I'm sorry if I say your name wrong. She sent me some jewelry from her mum's business and a cute little pen. <laughs> I love it. Thank you so much. I got this super cute drawing from Molly from the USA. A cute picture. How cute. I also got a little package from Made by Basic. She said she sent me a vegan makeup remover which is so nice of you thank you that's what the makeup remover looks like it's actually really cool packaging i like it and so just can smell this one <laughs> i i'm sorry to who sent this katie everything kind of melted <laughs> including these whoops this is super cute oh there's an address down there thank you so much katie this brand gave me a necklace which is really nice of them <laughs> this is awesome <laughs> Go online. Thank you, Penguin. <laughs> I've actually been meaning to read this. This is the second one though, isn't it? That's great. So I need to read the first one first. This is such a sweet little letter. Super cute. Look how much more stuff there is. So much. Oh, one of them got ripped open when my friend was, stop it. One of them got ripped open when our friend was house sitting. So you're really annoying me. Wait, do the scream for Scream as loud as you can. You can't scream first, go. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> you sound like, you know those videos of the goats when they yell? Oh, but you know how girls scream and they're like, ah! <laughs> and they're like, ah! Like real loud, I can't do it. Ah! <laughs> what are you doing, Louie? Look at him creeping closer and closer. Do, 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 do. Do you know he was sitting on my knee today when I was editing Hamish? Was he? Yeah. Wait, what's this? Charades. The fuck? You play charades on PlayStation. Oh, looks, uh, charades is for idiots. Or is it just like you have to do it and then it's on the computer instead of written down or whatever? I hate charades, so there's no way. Almost at all, as awkward as when you go somewhere and there's a big group of people, like eight people, and then they're like, hey guys, so to everyone get to know each other, we're going to say our favourite um, cartoon superhero, we're going to say where we're from, and then you're going to have to make a sound of an animal and everyone's going to have to guess it. <laughs> <laughs> like, how's that fun? Does anybody in here actually want to do this? No. no. Never. He loves my nails. Does he? Yeah. Da, 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 he like rubs da, 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 his face into does them. He? Look at his smile. Look at those teeth. The vet said he's got beautiful teeth. You hear that? Did you hear that? This is from Sydney. Look how cute her dogs are. I love this is from Janae and she said that she hopes that this is featured in my vlog. This did break. I'm sorry, but I love the drawing. At least it's still in the frame. The glass just broke out of the front of it. That'll be like the, the Mona Lisa story where it's kind of like, <laughs> why didn't he take his pants off? Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad you're happy because I won't yeah. come back again and do it all the time. Yeah. I very much oh. appreciate you like doing that. Alright, yeah. get out of there. Nice one. Oh, I'm still aching. And a foot into the mix. Now what happens? <laughs> a bit fancy, if, you know, if you think you're... This is what no. I struggle with. You know, we're looking at...